Welcome back to another GPI WSOP Player of the Year update. I'm Max Rabinovich, filling in for Laura Cornelius. We're headed into the 10th day here at the World Series of Poker, and as per usual, last night's action brought about more than its fair share of stories, as well as a shakeup in the Player of the Year standings. Event number 10, the 10K Heads Up No Limit, drew to a close with Keith Lear emerging with the bracelet and Paul Volpe settling for the runner's up spot. This win marks Lear's second lifetime bracelet victory, while Volpe, who's had a marquee start to the 2015 series, moves up into the number one spot on the GPI WSOP Player of the Year leaderboard. His second place finish and a 12th place showing in event number seven, the 10K limit deuce to seven triple draw, combined to give Volpe 641.6 points and make him the man to beat thus far. Meanwhile, event 11, the $1,500 limit hold'em is in the books as well, with William Kekan emerging as the victor after topping a tough final table that included Kevin Song, Shannon Shore, Brandon Cantu, and Russian ace Alexander Kostritsin. Moving on to today, event 12, the $1,500 six max no limit is one to watch with a stacked remaining field of 25 runners that includes the likes of Mike Watson, former November Niner Scott Montgomery, Craig McCorkle, and Global Poker Masters Team Ukraine alum Alexander Natenko. They're all trailing double bracelet winner Steve Bilarakis, though. Bilarakis, the youngest ever to win a bracelet at the WSOP, is the only player coming into day three with a million plus chip stack. The $2,500 Omaha Stud High Low Mixed event is down to 40 players coming into day 10 as well, and with two more events kicking off, including the 10K Pot Limit Hold'em Championship, it's shaping up to be another wild day of action at the Rio. That's not good news for the GPI WSOP Player of the Year leaderboard top three, though. Current leader Paul Volpe, Byron Caverman, now second with 575.23 points, and third place Bryn Kenny with 557.34 points will have to keep them pressing on the felt if they have any shot at holding on to their early leads. All right, well that's it from us today. For more information on the GPI WSOP Player of the Year standings, make sure to check us out at globalpokerindex.com forward slash WSOP. And until next time, take care and good luck.